What's up everybody, welcome back to Selenix Crypto and welcome to a trading education video. Um, I think this might be one of my best trading education videos, even though I'm recording it right now, so, so maybe it's a bad video, who knows, but um, I think it's one of my best ones because the website, the platform, the tool we'll be discussing in this video is super valuable, all right? And a lot of new traders don't know about this tool, don't know about the statistics, the stats that we'll talk about in this video that are absolutely crucial to understanding certain cryptos and their behavior and therefore allow you to trade them better, all right? Um, because I do want to say, I mean, there, there's a lot to crypto trading, all right? So risk management is, is hugely important, just understanding how to trade, etc. Uh, but that kind of goes into risk management as well. Technical analysis plays a big role as well. All of those things matter. But once you have those down, so once you you know you now know how to um, use an MACD or an RSI, even though I don't like those indicators, uh, or you know how to draw key levels, use Fibonacci retracement, then using this tool actually allows you to understand price movements better and to be able to predict them better. All right, that's how I use it. I use Leviatus because, or Levitas. Um, I think you need to pronounce it like Levitas. I use it every single day, all right, multiple times a day. I think I spend like an hour or two every day on this side just looking at numbers. Um, amazing life of a trader. Um, but even if you are a beginning trader, this, this website, this platform has real potential. And the best thing is that it's all for free, all right? They do have subscriptions, which I would definitely recommend you to check out. Um, personally, I, I have an account as well. This video is also made in a partnership with Levitas, um, but it's, it's one of my only partnerships where I actually reached out to them. Um, and I asked, can I make a video about your platform? Do you have a little bit more information that I can share? And that's why I'm making this video because I, I, I think this video has real, real, real potential for you. So this is, the, this is the website, all right? You have to make an account or at least if you make an account, you have a little bit more information. So I would recommend you to do that. You can just use your Google account, whatever. Um, and you get to this dashboard, all right? And for beginning traders, I 100% understand that it's overwhelming. You see a lot of numbers right here. Well, you have the top gainers and losers. I think most of people, most of you understand what that is. Um, but then you have options and, and uh, top perp swaps, volume and OI change. What is that? Uh, top perp swaps funding. What is that? It, it's a lot, all right? But I'll show you the, the, the most important um, dashboards and the most important charts you can have on Levitas if you're a beginning trader. There's a lot on there, all right? So if you're an experienced trader, there's a lot of numbers, that, that there's a lot of statistics that allow you to analyze and take your analysis game to a level higher, but all right. So the most important things are actually on this dashboard. On this dashboard, you can very easily see all the top gainers and losers. So it's a bit easier and a bit more uh, thorough. Uh, then coin market cap, for example, there you can see a little bit more, but here it's more precise and also more up to date. Then you see the funding, the funding rate. I made a video on that. I'll actually leave uh, in a pinned comment. I'll leave two videos, which I made on both how to use this platform to spot rallying cryptos before they rally and what funding rates are. Funding rates, also very important while trading. You can very easily check them right here over the last 24 hours. Um, and, and just check them throughout the day and you have the volume and the OI change. Um, now that's the one thing we'll focus on in this video. Volume and OI is basically, volume is how much money has been uh, traded in a cryptocurrency. So it shows how, uh, how many people are trading it. So usually then it's a little bit more volatile and stuff. And open interest is the dollar amount in open positions, all right? So open interest is open positions. So if the open, open interest changes by $380 million, like you see and can see right here, that means that the, the $380 million more has been added in open interest, or this is the total, I'm not sure. But so here at the top, you have all of these things you can actually take a look at. So you can take a, take a look at uh, statistics for certain exchanges. And then here on the left, you can uh, see perpetual swaps, so perpetual futures, futures and options for uh, different exchanges specifically. So if you want to see all of those numbers for Binance, for example, you can. Uh, you can check out the volume. You can check out which cryptos are trending. So this dashboard is absolutely amazing. 
you can see the liquidations, you can see the long to short ratio, uh, you can see the open interest divided by the volume, you can see the open interest uh, change, you can see the volume change, you can see the funding, you can see the price change, everything you need, all right? It's a lot, like I said, it's a lot of numbers, it's overwhelming, but once you get used to it, and once you actually know what everything means, and if you have any questions, please let me know down in the comments, it's one of the best tools to use. The main tool I wanted to show you, and, and you have way more. I mean, you can also check out uh, specific assets like Bitcoin right here. It's absolutely amazing. Like you, you can check out the performance of Bitcoin every month and see, for example, that October usually is quite bullish. November, not so much, at least in the last couple of years. You can see where the volume is coming from. You can see the open interest and how that's developing. Just a lot of numbers. All right, look at this. Isn't this amazing? I mean, for a trader, for, for an analyst, this is amazing. Um, I think. All right. But what we'll focus on is under the tab global. So that means basically an aggregate or all exchanges together. And what it allows you to see right here is again, the open interest. So how many positions are open, the volume. So how much is being transacted, the top gainers and losers. But if you go to perpetual swaps here, which is the type of derivative, like which is most traded, right? So most people trade on perpetuals and not on spot or on futures. Uh, perpetual swaps, by the way, are basically just futures without an expiration date. And you go to perpetual swaps and you have this dashboard right here. And I think this is like, like this is the dashboard I use a lot of times per day. So what you can see here is you can see all cryptos that are traded on most of the major exchanges and you can see what they're doing. So if the volume is going up, so that way, like I said, I'll leave a link down in the description to a video where I tell you how to use these numbers to actually find rally in cryptos, for example. But just on the first glance, you can check out the volume change, the open interest change. So then you can see what's traded, what's most likely to be volatile. You can check the open interest divided by the, the volume, for example. You can check out the long short ratio. So for example, uh, if you go to ID right now, you can see that uh, the long short ratio is absolutely massive. You can check the correlations. So, when, so if you want to know that if Bitcoin drops down, will this crypto drop down as well? Then you can check the correlations and make a decision based on that. Uh, you can check the funding, like you can see right here. So for example, the funding is very low right now on Floki and Engine. A lot of great numbers. Like I said, I'll leave some links down in the description how to use these numbers. Um, but this is basically what, and you can also filter it like this is the last 24 hours. You can also filter it to the last four hours to have some more recent changes, all that type of stuff. I would definitely, like I said, it's all free to check out. So I'll leave links to both Levitas and those videos I made on funding rates and how to spot ready in cryptos using Levitas down in the pinned comment. So check that out if you're interested in that, if you want to learn more about crypto trading. But this was my review on the number one tool to actually help you in your trading of crypto derivatives. If you have any questions, like I said, let me know down in the, uh, in, in, in the comments. But for now, thank you for watching. Take care and bye.